Hello, Vinegavia here and welcome to this Minecraft 1.13 Let's Play from the Diamond Society. I hope you're alright guys. I hope you're alright. Episode 9 guys. Episode 9. We started here not too long ago. And I want to look at some of the things we've done so far. Because you know what guys, this is the last episode. Last episode of the season I should say. Before you go bonkers at me. And uh, here we got a pig and a rabbit, they're best friends, and I'm gonna build this tower here as well. So we're gonna build an African watchtower in today's episode, and we're gonna look at what we've accomplished. So, we have we have the monastery here, guys. We have the monastery area, and we've built, I don't know, four buildings here or so. We're gonna build five with the tower, right? It all looks really good. We have a wall. We have a bridge going down. And I know we we finished this last episode, guys, and um, yeah, I mean, I'm just really pleased with it, <laughs> really pleased with the area. I was a little bit shocked when they said that we were going to reset. Um, well, I wasn't shocked, I was a bit sad and by the fact that we were going to reset, because I really like this place, you know? But then I thought, you know what, guys, I got in really late into the season, and uh, I don't want to be... You know, uh, on my own out here building my things all alone forever. You know, I do want the base, you know, and that's what I have now. But I want to be more collaborative. I want to, you know, build we with these fantastic builders that we have here on the server. Um, and uh, yeah, we have farms, we have storage here, and stuff like that. There are some things like I need windows and, you know, doors and. Things like that. I need to do interiors for things. But I think it's going to have to be what it is for now. And uh, yeah, I'm really pleased with this grove as well. How that turned out. It's really nice to do some custom trees. I love doing that sort of stuff. And uh, you know, it's just... Yeah, it fits. This area is really nice. That's what I'm trying to say. While it's night time, let's go in and have a look at the church. It's super colorful. Very colorful indeed. I went a bit crazy here, but I really like doing that from time to time, at least, you know. And uh, it feels it feels like it 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 became a really good build because it's based on something that we actually that actually exists, and uh, that's what I like about it. Now I don't have my enchanting set up, but that, that would have gone there. Here's the bedroom, <laughs> overlooking the church down there. And, you know, we have all the things we need in this base. We have a storage room down here. We have a furnace array here. You know, all the things are in place. We could have, uh, you know, got going now with the season properly. You know what I mean? This this is a proper base. And, uh, yeah, this is back out into the main here. This is a proper base. And this is kind of the time where we could have gotten uh, settled in and started doing the really big project. But uh, alas, we are going to reset. And the reason we're resetting, of course, is that 1.14 is around the corner, guys. And it's gonna be super exciting to go uh, into a new world for 1.14. I've, uh, I would have not been able to do that, actually, without the Diamond Society, because we are not resetting Lionheart Season 2. Lionheart Season 2 will continue indefinitely, guys. Although we will, of course, upgrade to 1.14, but over on Lionheart, I have already gotten all the stuff, and uh, yeah, so it's not a new world. All right, Watchtower, 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 American? No, <laughs> African Watchtower for Pete's sakes. Oh my days, what am I like? I'm gonna have to go and get more sandstone, but I figured we could do sort of the basics here together. Now I'm gonna borrow some inspiration from that over there, um, and but we're gonna have oak logs and we're gonna have sandstone. They go really well together. Even without the shaders, which we're going to look at now. Yeah, so there you go. Very nice uh, block combo in general, right? And I want it to be sort of a... Um, it's, it's, it doesn't use the same exact principle as over here. Um, in, in real life, if that makes any sense. Oh, that's a creeper over there. Hello, sir. You know, it doesn't use the same building technique at all. Uh, as we do over here, but I'm going to make it so that it does that anyway, because I, I just like it, you know? And so, for instance, in this case, we could have a beam going like this. Yoo-hoo! And then some of this could be stairs and things like that. Could be cool. Something like that, yeah. So that's the basis of it. And then we can have these tiny little windows going on with, um, 
well with stairs we can have just one stair for instance one stair windows like that yeah that's nice yeah I like that and then we can have things poking out with the buttons again same as before we can have two windows that are too wide as well or too tall like that or we can even have them actually and that might be a better idea have them taught too tall like this All right yeah I like that better uh, it can also be a combination and then we need some sort of other block as well here and I'm gonna figure that out some sort of just highlight block and it's gonna be not a very tall tower the purpose of the tower is to thank you is to uh, overlook the uh, the uh, surroundings here and to be able to protect to some extent I guess the monks uh, also it needs to be a bell tower so it needs to have some sort of bell functionality inside of it um, we might just do some fence and uh, and, a, and a gold block or something like that to symbolize that but it's gonna be a little bit taller than that maybe top here or something like that yeah let's have a look at it um, and see how I get on when it's finished guys all right let's have a look at this tower it's super simple guys but I think it's rather effective yeah buttons uh, some spruce some dark oak buttons quite random window slots or slits all around here right and then this little crenellation up top yeah very simple but quite effective I think um, African tower guys now let's put the bell in clock tower even so these here windows up top here you have to go up here to look at them right or look out of them but that's all right that's all right and this little bigger window I might have another bigger window maybe somewhere somewhere else maybe here actually let's try that and why would we do that guys what is to be expected from season four of diamond society um, well I don't quite know you know guys I am open to suggestions let's just put that there like that that's where we ring the bell everybody's happy going to church over there and over I can't see it <laughs> over there and uh, you know super simple build yeah but I think it rounds off this area nicely so we have like a start which is the bridge and we have an ending which is this clock tower this African clock tower over here um, and yeah I really like it I hope you do too there will be a world download of this map and that I recommend strongly recommend you go and look at it once it's available because this map is amazing there are some really talented builders here on Diamond Society and um, yeah so what is to be expected from season 4 guys well I will try my very best to be a little bit more communal than I managed to be in the season this season and that is because I started so late that everybody was basically so far ahead of me I couldn't really uh, play with them <laughs> without being ashamed of myself no but uh, you know they were doing things that I couldn't really compete with um, uh, or partake in but I'm hoping that season 4 is going to bring much more collaborations and if not if that's uh, not possible for time and scheduling reasons and things like that I'm hoping that because I plan to build quite a lot in spawn and near spawn or our spawn town that we will at least be able to look at what everybody else is building yeah that's about it uh, but yeah leave me comments what have you thought about the first season well my first season of diamond society short as it may have been and what would you like to see me do in the th in the well in the fourth season <laughs> my second season uh, let me know in the comments and uh, yeah thank you very much for joining me on this little adventure um, into the diamond society and I hope to see you in season four bye